So I have a problem with this design. No, it technically does work, but it's not really ADA accessible. Let me explain the problem that I had. So I built this little example from a previous YouTube video, and I'll also link this in the description below if you wanna see how I built these icons using both Bootstrap and Font Awesome. But I, for fun, I wanted to run a simple measure using web.dev, which is Google's measurement tool over how your site works and functions. And as I ran it, I saw I had a 93 of accessibility and I realized, well, why do I have a 93? It should be working fine. And as I scrolled down the page, it said, hey, links do not have a discernible name. As in this link doesn't know where it goes because it just says Facebook for the URL, but inside is just the picture of both Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and YouTube. I wanna show you how you fix that using something called Aria Label. And we're starting right now. All right, so whenever I wanna read about how to make my site completely ADA accessible, I check out the w3.org site. And on there, it has a certain page that talks about the using the ARIA labels for link purposes. In here, it describes, if I scroll down the page, that the ARIA label attributes provide a way to describe a descriptive label, text label, on an object such as a link when there are no visible elements on the page that describe the object. Well, visually, we have these icons of Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and YouTube, but in the code, if we come down here, all we have is the link and the picture. And while this I class has Instagram in it, it doesn't really describe where this link goes. So what it says to do inside of the ARIA label, if I scroll down the page, is to say A, href, and then ARIA label, read more about blank, blank, blank in this example. So in this case, what I would do is that in this a ref, I would say ARIA, if I could type ARIA properly, and I will say link to Facebook. Now I can just copy and paste this, and I'll change the next one down to Instagram, and we'll say link to Instagram. Now we're describing where these links are going. Now, of course, the next one will be Twitter. And the fourth one's gonna be TikTok, link to TikTok. And the last one is going to be YouTube. Now, if I save this project, and what I'll do is let me bring over a little Netlify action over here. And what I'll do is I'm gonna upload this project. And dragging and dropping, I uploaded a new version. Now, if I refresh this page, nothing has changed on the website. However, if we rerun this, I'm gonna come back to web.dev, come back up, switch URL, which is the same URL, run the audit, and now what's gonna happen is this is gonna check the newly formed accessibility area courtesy of ARIA label. We should find after it's finished, come on, come on, it's almost done, there it is. Now we get that pure 100 of accessibility, and if we scroll down the page, we can see that there is no more problem to be had courtesy of the ARIA label.